so it's been a little minute since I reacted on Wine Glass and Chill, but I've been seeing her post some questionable things. So I was like, all right, let's talk about it. Not to mention she rubbed me the wrong way when she flip flopped and started bashing other reactors. So now I'm on that ass, okay? Now, listen, let me start by saying this, okay? She's boring. I tried to catch up on some of her videos and I could only get through so many. One video, she literally had the camera on her for damn near five minutes while she was eating a bowl of cereal. And that just lets you know that she is doing the most to cash in on this watch time. Just like she's playing that 24 hour cleaning compilation, I believe it's been about three, four, five months now since she's been playing that. Like girl, but listen, even though I'm talking shit, I can't even be mad because inflation is real. And where I'm at, chicken is like 18 to $27 per pack. So I get it. But don't come on here and brag about having all this money and you're doing the most for a few dollars. I never said nothing to my fans to ever send me money. I'm not trying to give nobody sympathy of what's going on in reality and real life here in my house. I don't want no money. I don't want nothing. I took all my stuff off. Yeah, I got money I can play around with in the damn pool right there. Right. But they say, yeah, I got money I can play around with in the damn pool right there. Right. But, but they say, so let's move on. One video that I saw, I believe it was yesterday or today, but she mentioned wanting to respect Bay's privacy and not filming him. But I think it's because everybody was getting on his ass about not doing shit but sitting at that computer. And it's crazy to me how you want to respect his privacy, yet you had your babies private part on live not too long ago i don't know if y'all caught that but uh, a few reactors were talking about it but i'm just like you didn't think that was worth covering up you sitting here talking about privacy and i can't stand women like that that do the most when it comes to their bae and their husband and their boo and their boyfriend but then when it comes to their kids they don't really have that same energy and then you decided to wait until that baby got sick to clean up that house. And that's definitely one of the reasons why his ass stays sick. Now, I know she said she got her moments of depression, but I'm thinking she's one of those people that uses it to be filthy. And not to mention, she sees that it's literally like a cash cow. So I feel like she just walking through that motherfucking dumping shit all around. So she got something to film. I don't know. That girl just be rubbing me the wrong way. Like I want to see her win, but she just, oh, I don't know. And then let's talk about the fact that she has six box braids in the back of her head for like a week. And for me, I feel like she can't even do her hair because she has to do all of the other work in the household. He needs to get his ass up wash some clothes vacuum sweep clean off that nasty ass stove and anything else damn it my mom is losing it yeah i'm but using it i'm it. you gonna have to wait in just a few uh, seconds uh, yeah uh, it's on 15 percent uh, yours never be on 15 percent so i know you got juice ow. but yeah no, right now. oh my god so in my opinion, she's gonna keep his ass out the camera. So it looks like she's doing all these things solely for her channel. When in all actuality, his ass is just lazy. And we know that. Now, one thing I will say though, her channel has definitely grown. And that's a good thing because she got multiple mouths to feed. So her growth will benefit the kids. So, you know, kudos to her. But I feel like some things she do is just tacky and she know it. Just like some of the stuff that she be saying, like, I don't know if, you know, she didn't make it through school all the way or like, I don't know. And I'm not even being funny, but I'm being dead ass. But it's like some of the stuff she be saying don't even make no damn sense. She be trying to sound super educated and she end up just sounding slow. So happy I'm done with this hairstyle. It's so cute and it's so vi like diverse, like diverse. Yeah, y'all, I can't wait to get done with this. Let me cut these salaries and get this stuff over with because y'all, I don't wanna cut these salaries. And remember how she made a video bragging about how her bae got her a new phone and a computer and he got her this and that. So why was she talking about waiting to get taxes to finish furnishing her room and her living room? What happened to bae and his money? He makes his own income, oh yeah. So I'm going to spend my base money because he got paid last week, Friday. So I got money. Me and Bay is like this. We don't even argue. We don't even fight. 
Bay does well to me. Bay does well to me. Y'all remember that necklace that was right here that said diamond? He brought that for me. $300. The computer. The black couches. He brought that for us. The kitchen table. My ring. He brought that for me. This phone, my iPhone 14. He brought that for me for a Christmas present. He has money. He don't look like it, but he has money. 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 He's not broke. And that's how you know they were just trying to flex because people called him out. She's sitting here struggling while they were so-called homeless. And everybody was like, okay, well, why isn't your man out doing something? Make him do something so you guys got some money, you know? And she was like, oh, well, he got money. We got a whole bunch of money. Where is that? Because now, why you got to wait till taxes? Like, what's going on? I thought he was balling. And let's be real. If y'all was balling like that, y'all would not be sleeping on that twin size ass bed. Y'all cannot possibly be getting a good night's sleep on that shit. And listen... This is all jokes and opinions. I'm just having a little fun. Um, a lot of y'all have been in y'all feelings about my commentary lately. So I just had to give y'all that little disclaimer that nothing should be taken serious. It's all just entertainment purposes only. Um, somebody tried to compare my commentary to Tasha K. Listen, I'm not on here talking about nobody having STDs or anything like that. And Tasha K was told to remove the video and she chose not to. So that is not the same thing. Nothing I'm saying is a fact, is all opinion and entertainment and that's about it. With that being said, make sure y'all lock in with me, comment below and I'm gonna catch y'all in the next one.